It's pumpkin season, so let's make some adorable pumpkin hand pies. Hi there, foodie friends. My name is Parley, and welcome back to my channel, Adventures in Yum. First, we're preparing the pumpkin pie filling. To a mixing bowl, we're adding one cup or about 246 grams of canned pumpkin puree, two tablespoons of heavy cream, two tablespoons of brown sugar, two tablespoons of granulated sugar, half a teaspoon of pumpkin pie spice, pinch of salt, and one large egg. We whisk this mixture until everything is well combined and then we'll set it aside for now. Next, we're rolling out our pie crust on a lightly floured surface. You can certainly use store-bought crust, but I love to make my own, so if you'd like the recipe, make sure to check out the description for the recipe video link. Once we rolled out our dough to about 1 8 inch thick, we use a pumpkin shaped cutter to cut the pie crust. Combine the scraps so that we can later re-roll and cut those into more pumpkins. For the first set, I decided to do a mixture of plain pumpkins and, of course, some jack-o'-lanterns. To make the faces of the jack-o'-lantern hand pies, use a paring knife to carefully cut the faces into some of the pie dough pieces. We then spoon some of the pumpkin mixture into the middle of half of the pumpkin shaped pie dough pieces. I honestly don't measure how much I add, I just go by sight, but it's probably about two to three tablespoons of filling. However, make sure to not overfill them or else the filling will leak out the side and make a little bit of a mess. Before we finish these fun and tasty treats, if you're getting value out of this video, then please make sure to hit that like button, click subscribe, and ring that bell to be notified about my latest video. Next, we prepare our egg wash. For mine, I use one whole egg and a splash of whole milk. After we give that a thorough mix, we brush it onto the pie dough around the pumpkin filling. We then place our second piece of pie dough on top and line it up with the bottom pie dough and then press the prongs of a fork into the perimeter of the pie dough. We continue this around the outside of the dough in order to completely seal it, ensuring that the filling will stay inside of the hand pie. For our plain pumpkins, I use a paring knife to poke a few little holes in the top to allow steam to escape. We then brush the tops of the ham pies with more of our egg wash, bake them at 400 degrees Fahrenheit or about 204 degrees Celsius for about 20 to 25 minutes or until they're golden brown. Let's see what it looks like when we break one of these open. The crust is nice and flaky and the inside tastes like pumpkin pie. These treats are so easy and fun to make, especially when you have fun with the faces that you can create on top of the jack-o'-lanterns. Let me know in the comments if you give these a try and how you like them. If you're interested in checking out some of the products I used in this video, then please make sure to check out that video description below for some of their Amazon links. Thank you so much for joining me today, foodie friends. I'll see you next time for another yummy adventure.